guys, this is Teacher SP and welcome back to my channel. So for today's lesson, it's a continuation of our lesson. So ang una kong diniscuss is the law of sign at ngayon naman po is law of cosine. So pareho po yun sila, spherical uh, triangle. So kanina, law of sign and uh, the formula is very simple. Tapos ngayon is law of cosine. And if you are interested in this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and tap the notification bell so that you will be updated for whatever videos I'm going to upload. Guys, we have here law of cosine for sides. Ibig sabihin, dalawa po yun eh. May law of cosine for sides, meron din pong law of cosine for angles. And today, uh, I will be showing you the law of cosine for sides. This is the formula that we are going to use. For cosine angle A, the formula is cosine side B. So take note, yung maliliit na letters ay tinatawag po natin na sides. At ang small letters ay, a big letter ay tinatawag po natin ang angle. Cosine side C plus sine side B, sine side C, cosine angle A. For cosine side B, cosine A, cosine C, plus sine A times sine C times cosine angle B. And cosine side C is equal to cosine A, cosine B, plus sine A, sine B cosine angle C. Now, ngayon po, I have here a given and we are going to apply the three formulas. Ibig sabihin ng cosine, log cosine for sides, tatlong sides po ang given at hinahanap po natin ang angle. So, dito po sa ating example, given a spherical triangle, ABC with A, 48 degrees, side B, 60 degrees, and side C is equal to 55 degrees. We are looking for find angle A. So, saan po dito? 1, 2, 3. Ito po ang gagamitin natin. Okay. Para po na, because we are going to derive the formula, since cosine angle A ay nasa right side. And what are we going to do? Pag lipat po natin, or we are going to transpose our uh, mga given po natin, mga formula natin dito sa kabila para maiiwan po yung angle A. So, ngayon, let us start. How are we going to do that? Mamaya na tayo mag-transpose or substitute ang given. So, ngayon, ito po yung number 1 natin gagamitin. So, here, cosine A. Okay, so itong cosine A ngayon, itong part na ito class is you are going to transpose it to the other side. When you are transposing a number, nagbabago po ang sign, magiging negative po siya. Ibig sabihin, ito po isang term lang po. Ito lang po magbabago, negative cosine B, pero ang C, hindi na po magbabago. So, that is negative cosine B and then cosine C. Okay. Equals sine B and then sine C Cosine angle A. So, since na hinahanap po natin ang angle A, we have to divide both equation by sine B, sine C. Para po, makancel na po natin ito, di ba? Sine B and then sine C. Cancel, cancel, and then dito po ay sine B, sine C. So, ibig sabihin, ito na po class ang ating formula. Maiiwan na po dito ang cosine angle A. So, ito na po yung formula natin. So, what are we going to do is, we are going to substitute our given. Okay, so let us substitute. So, cosine A, anong A po natin? Sa given, 48. So, cos 48 degrees, open and close parenthesis, minus cos the 
uh, side B is equal to 60 degrees times cos side C, which is 55 degrees. Okay? Divided by sine naman po. So, that is equal to sine B, which is 60 degrees. And then sine 55 degrees. Okay, so ngayon, pupunin na po natin ang sagot. I can I raise this the writings on the board. So dito na po, continuation ng ating law of cosine. So everybody, hold your calculator, scientific calculator. So you press, okay, cos, and then 48 symbol, close parenthesis. Okay? So, equals. So, that is 0 0.6691. So, lalagyan po natin kasi isa-isahin po natin. So, magiging angle A na po ito. So, that is 0 0.66913 minus the product of this. So, i-press uh, naman po natin ang calculator natin. Cos 60. Uh, symbol, which is the degree minutes and seconds, close parenthesis, and then cos 55 symbol, close parenthesis, equals. Ano po yung sagot? So that is equal to 0 0.2867 over, so get the product of this again, sine 60, tapos symbol, close parenthesis, times sine 55 symbol and then close parenthesis equals so ang sagot po dyan ay 0 0.7094 taga-apat lang ngayon gagawin po natin di ba cos A so we have to do the operation class so ang sagot ay ano po natin ang at sa ating calculator everybody if you have your calculator with you there so, 0 0.66913 minus 0 0.2867 equals, okay, divided by 0 0.7094 equals. So, ang sagot po dyan, class, is equal to 0 0.2867. 53908. Ngayon, ang gagawin po natin, so, hindi nyo na po i, ano po yun, i, uh, i didrit. Diretsyo nyo na po. That's the right time that you are going to press the shift. Shift. Okay, cosine. Kasi log cosine tayo, cosine equals, ang lumabas po dyan ay 57.37. 57.37. And that's the right time that you are going to press the degree, minutes, and seconds. So, that is equal to 57 degrees and 23 minutes. Why 23 minutes? Kasi ang seconds niya ay naka 41. So, you have to round it off. So, that's it guys. So, halimbawa naman po kung gagamitin mo po ang angle B. Hinahanap po yung angle B. Same process din po. Whatever process that I did for angle A, yun na rin po. Basta importante is you are going to substitute the given. How about the angle C? Same for process na itatranspose mo po ito on the other side, divide both equation para po ma-cancel. Ang maiiwan po yung anun po. So, thank you guys for watching and have a great day everyone.